It's our first day back from spring break, and you know we brought back our students in actually preschool as well, preschool through second grade. They are participating in our simultaneous teaching model. We had small cohorts of students where the teachers were able to troubleshoot and learn how to conduct simultaneous teaching. Those teachers then became models and professional learning developers for the rest of our staff, and it really set us up for success when it came to bringing back the students. So our teachers were ready to have kids back. Welcome back, Rooster. Hi, Catherine. We are not taking temperatures at the door. We would only do that if we have a child that claims they're not feeling well. Then we have a whole safety protocol for that. But our parents were provided with and instructed to use the checklist. They have a tool that they use which walks them through the different symptoms their child could be feeling. And if any one of those symptoms is present, then the child is to stay home and they're to alert the, the school. If a child presents a particular symptom that would preclude them from um, participating in person, but they're well enough to continue to learn, they can do that from home. And that's the nice part of our simultaneous model is they don't miss out on the learning. I do have one teacher that was not able to return because of health reasons. And we do have uh, substitute teachers that were trained on how to provide um, instruction both online and with students in, in front of them. In fact, I do have three teachers that went on a maternity leave. <laughs> And so we have substitute teachers that are on our preferred sub list here at our school who are also very tech savvy and were able to pick up the job with much ease. The most exciting part of today for me is seeing the children learning in the classrooms, seeing them receive the in-person small group intervention. You know, that is still possible through online, but when you have a child in front of you, there's more control that you, that you can uh, exercise when providing intervention for a child.